Good morning, y'all. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome to Vlogtober Day 15. Good morning. How you doing? Hope you're having a great day. Hope you're having a great week. Uh, today is Saturday. And we are just going to keep on moving, keep on pushing, okay? So, look, this is going to be part two of a clip that I'm getting ready to insert here. Of me attempting to recover my desk with contact paper. Now, I ran out of contact paper. I had no idea that this, I just totally forgot that this desk was a lot bigger than what it was. The measurements that I thought the desk was, was definitely off. So I had to order another roll of contact paper. So this is going to be part two of me resurfacing my office, home office desk. Okay, you guys? So check it out. Let me show y'all the progress so far. Okay? Let me, let me show y'all the end result of part one so we can start part two. Okay? So here's the final look. Did a little cleaning up of her, you know, just, just tightened up a little bit. Um, there were some straggly pieces that the razor did not get. So I had to go through back over it. But this is it. This is the surface. I am loving her. She's looking amazing. And yeah. So guys, if you are indecisive as to the type of furniture that you want, um, and you really want to make over a piece of furniture, by all means, please use contact paper. It works. It is durable and it gives you a sense of style as in what the furniture would look like if it was that type of furniture, if you know what I mean. So I am indecisive as to if I'm going to get an all black desk in here or a black top desk with white at the bottom. I don't know. I, I really don't know. So that's why I went to try this look to see if it would go with the room. So it saved me some time and saved me some money. Um, and it also saved me from making an indecisive decision when I'm really not sure. You know what I mean? So by all means, if you are 
Have made up your mind as to what type or color of or style furniture that you want. And you see contact paper that is remotely, that's, that's kind of similar to what you want. Please try it. It's easy application. It's not hard. It just takes a few minutes. Um, some people use different tools in order to apply the contact paper. I am almost a contact paper queen. I've redone this desk probably four times and it, it, it it's easy. You know, it, it's easy for me to just use my hands instead of using a credit card or using the actual um, tool that comes with some of wallpaper, um, some of contact papers um, when you purchase it. But I'm loving this. Um, I think it goes really well with the rug and also the other accents in the room. So you guys, I will see you guys in the next clip. <laughs> and here is the finished look. Absolutely loving her. She gives just the right amount of black that I wanted for this space. Definitely. Beautiful. I'm satisfied. Hey guys. <laughs> So I'm back. Of course, it's been many, many, many hours later. Um, I did complete the desk, as you saw, but I had to make a run back to Walmart to pick up this. Let me show you. So I picked up another five shelf bookcase. <sighs> yeah, the dilemma is I'm not sure which side of the room is going to go on. Excuse me. Sorry. Um, as you can see, I have two already. These are the two bookshelves that I already have from Walmart. They are on sale for $30, $35. Yeah, $35. So if you're looking for some bookshelves, I think the only color that was on sale was the white. Check out Walmart. They have them on sale online. So this is the other bookshelf, right? I am thinking about putting it here. And moving this over, getting rid of this table, or moving all three bookshelves on this side of the room, okay? Which would make for a really, really nice backdrop for when I film my videos and move the clothes on this side of the room. So, you guys, that's the dilemma. I don't, I'm, I really don't feel like <laughs> playing around with it and taking everything out and then changing it over because what if I don't like it? And then it's going to be like, okay, you got to go back and put it back the way that it was. So that's my dilemma right now. I'm trying to, actually, I'm going to do a sketch on paper to see how it looks. Um, but yeah, I, I need to free up some of that space. That bookshelf, the bookshelves are just too crowded. And I need to free up some space. So, and it's going to take, it's going to take me to get used to having my clothes on this side of the room as opposed to this side. So you guys, I don't know. That's the dilemma. I'm going to marinate on it, do a little sketch. I'm not, I'll probably start some of it today or this after this evening, but I probably really get in deep tomorrow. So with that being said, you guys, I'm going to close out today's Vlogtober video and I'm going to get back with you guys tomorrow.